y'all welcome back to my channel or if you're new here welcome my name is Charmaine and today we're going to be meal prepping lunch for the week I'm just starting here by cleaning off my sweet potatoes and I'm going to poke some holes in them and put them in the oven at 400 degrees since these will take the longest to cook and then we'll go ahead and get started on the rest of our meal And the first meal is going to be shrimp. So I'm gonna go ahead and add some minced garlic, some ground cumin, onion powder, uh, Creole seasoning, accent, low sodium um, seasoning salt, and then some Weber roasted garlic and herb. And I'm gonna mix it up and then season the other side. And then we're gonna put it in a pan with some olive oil until it turns pink. For the salmon, it's going to be real simple. I'm just doing some olive oil and some minced garlic. And then I will add the salmon and some of this Laurie's Hawaiian marinade to the pan. And it comes out so delicious. Normally, I do also add pineapples to this, but I did not have any when I was making this meal. So, I had to go without it. Um, but while this is cooking, I did also have some steamable vegetables that I was making. So, I had a bag of mix ve mixed vegetables and also a bag of broccoli that I just went ahead and heated up in the microwave and then um, I cooked all of that and then we'll go ahead and plate it after this is done. I'm just gonna go ahead and plate everything. Um, I do have my food scale out that way I can divide up the shrimp into three servings um, because this was a Monday that I did make all of this. So one of them was my dinner for that day and then the rest for my lunch for the week. Um, so I just divided everything up um, as evenly as I could between all of the meals. Um, so for one meal, it was the shrimp, broccoli, and the sweet potato. And then the other one was the Hawaiian salmon, mixed vegetables and sweet potato.
Um, so I did have the sweet potatoes in the oven for about an hour and a half. So I'm just going to check them um, to make sure that they are done all the way through. And they were. Um, so I did just go ahead and let them cool off for about an hour while I did my workout and took a shower, which is why I changed. Um, and I'm just going to put them in the containers and mash them up. And that'll be all. And y'all, that's all for today's video. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And make sure that you do follow me on TikTok because I do post daily what I eat in a day videos over there. Thanks so much for watching. Peace.